Hi, this is Tudor Nick P, and this is Lesson 632. The title of today's lesson is The Difference Between Guardian, Bodyguard, and Security Guard. Okay, somebody wants a screenshot, do it right now, let's get right to it. All right, first we start with Guardian. Uh, a person who has been legally appointed, especially by a court, to look after another person, especially a child, uh, whose parents are not around anymore, or a mentally ill person. Right, that's the first meaning. We've got a second meaning for guardian. The guardian of something is someone who defends and protects it. Okay, here's bodyguard. Bodyguard is a person or a group of people uh, you uh, hired to protect an important person from being attacked by an enemy or unstable person. So bodyguards usually are focused on protecting a single individual person. Uh, our security guard. A uh, security guard is a person hired to protect a building uh, or pick up and deliver large amounts of money. Okay, so you, already you can see there are some clear differences between them. All right, and we got uh, several examples here to show how it's used. Here's the first one. After his parents died, the boy's aunt adopted him and became his legal guardian. So she became the legal guardian of him. The parents are not around anymore. That's a perfect example of guardian. Number two, ever since her father had uh, an advanced case of Alzheimer's, she became his guardian. Yeah, maybe, you know, his brain is just not working anymore. So she's the guardian for him, making most of his, you know, legal decisions. All right, let's continue. Uh, number three, the Marvel company has a superhero team called Guardians of the Galaxy. All right, so this is the guardian that defends and protects something there, defending the galaxy. All right, number four, that uh, Singer hired a bodyguard, you know, for an individual person, to protect, uh, to protect her from crazed fans, you know, in case there's any crazy fan that wants to hurt her. Uh, number five, many politicians have a security detail of a team of bodyguards. Yeah, if you're important enough, you probably don't even have a single one. You might have several working together, uh, especially a politician or, you know, again, some other important person. Uh, number six, he is a security guard of that museum, and he works the night shift. So, again, this is protecting an individual building. And the last one, most security guards for Brinks trucks deliver and take money from banks and are usually armed. Have yeah, you ever seen those uh, guards that are picking money up or dropping money off at a bank? Uh, yes, they are definitely security guards as well. Okay, anyway, I hope you got it. I hope you got a better feel of when you would use one and use the other. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.